Hey everyone, I'm Tyler Mousianis and I'm currently studying to be a physical education teacher. So today my thoughts are going to be geared towards PE students. Um, in today's world, it isn't enough to just learn how to read, write, and perform math. We live in an evolving world where things are constantly changing, and for today's teachers that means using every resource at our disposal. Um, teachers must now hold their students to higher standards. And in today's video, I will be discussing the four C's. So the four C's are creativity, collaboration, communication, and critical thinking. These four concepts, when put together, embody someone who is ready for higher education and the workforce. The first of the four C's is critical thinking. Critical thinking means analyzing how parts of a whole interact with each other to produce overall outcomes in complex systems. Um, for example, again, since I'm doing PE, my students will need to research nutrition and exercise plans and select one they'll use for my class. They'll also need to write out how to how the two complement each other. Um, sorry. So I am definitely reading off of notes. So if I get lost or stuck, bear with me. It's my first time doing a YouTube video. Um, so again, yeah, like I was saying, for example, my students will need to research nutrition and exercise plans and uh, select one they'll use for my class. They'll also need to write out how the two complement each other and how they can benefit from each. And I'd also like my students to solve different kinds of unfamiliar problems in both conventional and innovative ways. So that's just another idea related to critical thinking. Um, for instance, asking them to create a cardiovascular workouts without any of the conventional methods. So for example, running, swimming, cycling, etc. Um, the second concept is communication. Communication in my classroom will include articulating thoughts and ideas using oral, written, and nonverbal communication skills in a variety of forms and contexts. Um, they will also need to listen effectively to decipher meaning, including knowledge, values, attitudes, and intentions. So some of the activities that I'll employ that will require these forms of communication will include working in groups in a, in a diverse classroom. Sorry about that. Stuttering a little bit. Um, they'll be asked to create activities in groups and then post them online. Um, they will need to work together and act professionally and respectfully to everyone in the group. So just being professional, being respectful of everyone, I think that's really important. Um, collaboration is the next idea, and in my opinion, goes hand in hand with communication. Without it, things can't be accomplished um, or completed. So, I want my students to be respectful of others and be open to sharing information and ideas. I'll require them to do plenty of group assignments, and everyone will need to bring the ideas to the group. Nobody is going to be a passive learner, um, it's going to be a silent passerby. I want people to actively speak up. Um, share their ideas so that way everyone can learn from each other and we're just building off of each other and building that community of learners which I think is important. Um, another of the four C's, the last one, is creativity and I believe it's essential for solving problems and improving upon our daily activities. When something is stopping us from being efficient or getting things done correctly, we can create a new process in order to improve our efficiency Creativity also allows students to show their personal interests and ideas through projects and group assignments. So I think if we as educators are able to implement these ideas into our lesson plan, then we can prepare our students not only for other subjects and higher level of learning, but the workforce. And I th obviously that's why we go to school, is to learn and hopefully someday make money and a job. Um, so that will conclude my video for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it and found it useful. Um, and yeah, until next time, goodbye. Okay, stop recording. Still going.